Hello, it's me again, definitely with another biased QTech review. And the first thing I noticed when I started playing with the Q is that all my friends came up to me and said to me like, wow, what's that? I did not know that QTech is making this kind of cues. Not only am I going to review QTech's new TrueBoot generation cues, but you will also be able to win one of these cues worth almost a thousand dollars. This is a very special video. At the end of the video, you will get more information on how you can win this beautiful almost 1000 euros or dollars worth of a queue. So stay tuned. And before I start the actual review of the new QTech TrueBoot Gen 2 queue, I want to share the emotions and the feelings I had when I had the chance to get hold of this beautiful new queue of QTech. Because I made a video, it's not a promotion video made by QTech or an advertising video made by them. This video is actually made by me. And after these 45 to 50 seconds, I'll promise you, I will share everything I tested and reviewed with this new beautiful piece of art. So stay with me, enjoy the next 45, 50 seconds, and then we'll dive into the review. Welcome back, hope you liked this little clip and it gave you the same emotions and goosebumps it gave me when I edited it. Anyway, as promised, let's dive into the review. QTech as a company definitely upped their game when it comes to the design of this Q. The Q I actually got is the new Truewood Generation 2 Q by QTech. The first thing I noticed when I unpacked this beautiful piece of art was that it definitely feels a little bit different, not in terms of weight, but just in terms of how it feels in your hand in my palm. Because it's featuring an all new construction, utilizing Qtex ClearTech epoxy resin finish for increased stiffness. And the fun part, it also reduces vibrations and that's also one thing I noticed immediately when I start playing with this cue. Every True Root Series cue is enveloped in exotic veneers surrounding a clean, dried Canadian maple core and is adorned with precision cut True Root shield rings. Personally, I so appreciate this design and I like these design gimmicks on the cue. This cue is available with the player's choice of Synergy 11.8 or 12.5 carbon fiber composite shaft. And I got the 19 ounce version, which I definitely can add or adjust with, the, with q -Tech's own weight system. I just used q -Tech's weight system, adjusted the weight of the cue, took me like three, four minutes and off we go. My cue is a no leather wrap cue. But you can order a leather wrap cue, which Qtech calls the Litchi wrap, which is super comfortable like any other leather out there. And those of you who follow my channel for a little bit longer already, they know that I try to convert my cues anyway to a leather wrap, no matter if they have a linen wrap or if it's a no wrap cue. For me, it was a little bit difficult to get used to this kind of cue because it has no wrap. So at the beginning, I was a little bit hesitant if I would like playing with a cue like this. The design definitely blew me away from the beginning. 
but I was not so sure about the wrapping or in this case, no wrapping. So I was super surprised when I played with this cue because I was afraid when I have like sweaty hands that it will not feel very good. But similar with Qtex Breach Break Q, which also has no wrap, I felt very comfortable very quickly and I actually started to appreciate it. For me, I will definitely keep the cue as it is and I started to enjoy playing without a wrap. Not sure how you would feel about it or if you would appreciate it. To me, it definitely works. One of the first questions you definitely want to have answered is how the cue plays. And since you guys know that I play Q-Tech anyway, I can tell you one thing for certain. This cue plays as perfectly brilliant and precise as any other Synergy cue from Q-Tech. And I just like playing with this cue because just looking at the cue just makes me wanna go to the table. All my friends and other people I don't even know when I just entered the club, knowing that I'm the Q-Tech guy, came up to me and says like, aren't you playing Q-Tech anymore? And in the moment I told them, no, this is an actual true root cue from Q-Tech with a Synergy 15K shaft, they were just blown away. If you already own a Q-Tech cue, if you already own an extension of Q-Tech, especially a Duo extension, it will fit perfectly to the cue because you just screw it on to the bottom of the cue. It's already pre-prepared to take on the Duo extension from Q-Tech, so you will have no problems using it. A little downside when it comes to the extension is that you will definitely not be able to use the older extensions from Qtech. They will definitely fit in, they will definitely screw on, but they leave a gap between the butt of the queue and the beginning of the extension, which is definitely not a nice or comfortable feeling when you play or hold the queue. And if you don't own a Duo extension or a new extension of Qtech, just get yourself one. It's definitely worth it because the transition between the end of the butt and the beginning of the extension is definitely seamless and it's just a nice feeling to play with this kind of connection between extension and butt of the queue. And I want to compare the different cues I'm currently using with and for you. You folks out there know that I already use two kind of Synergy 15K cues from Qtech. The two cues I already use from Qtech is the Ghost Edition and the white one from the SVB Edition. And both of them have been converted from linen wrap to leather wrap by one of my cue maker friends. But the Truewood Gen 2 generation actually comes with a leather wrap if you want to order it like this. What's actually the difference apart from the design? And for the Qtech nerds outside, this is definitely going to be interesting for you because I only noticed this when I bought my SVB Ghost Edition version. The shaft the Truewood Gen 2 Q is coming with is actually the same shaft which you get if you would use the Ghost Edition. And the difference between the Gen 1 and the Gen 2 shafts is actually the joint connection between the butt of the queue and the actual shaft. Because with the older shafts you have a silver ring and then a smaller black ring at the end of the shaft or the beginning of the shaft, whatever way you want to look at it. But with the Ghost Edition and especially here with the Truewood Gen 2 Edition, it comes with the new QTEC 15K shaft, meaning just with this black little ring, which makes it more slick, more stealth, and to me, more beautiful. If you would ask me what I like most about this Q, I would give you the following answer. It's definitely the connections between the joints, the wood part, and the part where you grip the Q. The team of QTEC definitely put some thoughts into the design of these little gimmicks to connect these wooden parts with the other parts of the queue. And if you look a little bit closer, you recognize how detail-oriented QTEC worked here. And at the end of the video, as promised, I'm going to explain to you how you can win this queue worth almost a thousand dollars. The first part is very easy. 
just like and subscribe to the channel. If you have already subscribed, then it's even better. The second part is equally easy. By acquiring a raffle ticket for just $30, you can join in and win this beautiful queue. Just go to the description of this video, just down below, read the instructions, and once you acquired your raffle ticket, you are in. The winner of this beautiful queue is going to be announced on December 11th, 6 p.m. Central Eastern European time, live here on YouTube. I hope you enjoy this video and you take part in the raffle to win this beautiful queue. And also let me know if you want to have anything else reviewed other than what I did in this video. I appreciate that you took your time and that you watched this video and I hope that we can see us in the next one.